Let's now talk about concatenation with strings. And that's just a fancy way of saying combining strings or adding them together. And we can add strings together by using the plus operator. So we could make a new string variable and say that equals the value of string one plus the value of string two. Let's take a look at an example of that. So if we come over here to idle and we say string one is assigned the value of hello, and string two is assigned the value of there, let's say string three is string one plus, oops, st string one plus string two. And now what happens if we print string three to the screen to the screen here? It hello there. So we've added those characters just as they are within the string, no space characters. So it's all combined. And that is what I mean. Uh, that is what we mean when we say concatenation or adding these strings together. Now, what if we're trying to uh, add a, a, an integer uh, and we want to combine that with a string? Well, if we want to say my integer is assigned five, we, what if we try to combine string one plus my integer? I'm going to throw an error. You can only concatenate string to string, not integers. That's just a Python rule. So we can convert the integer to a string and then combine it, combine it with strings. So we could say, let's say string four is assigned a, a value of string one plus, and here's where the Python, uh, Python knows what to do with this. We say string, str, we see how that's a different character a different color, sorry. And we can say my integer within those parentheses. This is running a function, running a method that's built into Python, this str method, which converts my integer to a string. So now we can combine these two strings together without an error. And then if we print string four, we see we've combined string one and my integer, just like that. So that's a handy way to combine strings, um, uh, to combine a string with an integer.